Hey. How are you doing? Fine, and you? I'm fine. Uh, thank you for welcoming me here. It's your uh, Monaco. Well, how was it for you to uh, see the boys again in the hotel? It was really nice, yeah. I didn't see them for a long time, so I appreciate it. Yeah. So you're going to show me Monaco, right? Yeah. In your car? Yeah, come so on. So let's go. <laughs> so, Olivier, how are you doing? Where are you in your rehabilitation process right now? I'm doing good, thank you. Um, my, um, my rehab center is in San Rafael and I'm working there now for two months. So it's really good. I'm improving every day. I have a lot of exercise to do things. Of course, I'm still in contact also with the guys here and uh, that I can, they can control and they can see what I do. So it's, for the moment, it's really a good way. Yeah. Okay, take us back to the moment you got injured. What happened exactly? Yeah, I was 10th of April. <laughs> against uh, Valvike, yeah. It was a normal contact, like every game I have some contact like this. But at this time, I don't know if it was some tiredness or bad luck. I think it's bad luck, but yeah. And my knee turned and the ACL turned, so yeah. It's like a normal contact, but uh, at this moment, my knee uh, can't handle it. Yeah, you got surgery, right? Yeah, I was, op uh, I got the operation the 5th of May. And um, I start the rehab one month later, so mm -hmm. I'm happy with this because the yeah the process is really good and uh, yeah you can see now I can drive normally so it's it's good. Yeah, is it safe? <laughs> yeah, yeah, sure. Okay. <laughs> well, why did you choose to have your rehab over here? Yeah, it was important for me to uh, to put my head out of uh, of Eindhoven because we have a lot of games and uh, was a tough tough moment for me and. Uh, was good for me to to come back to where I was born and where I lived when I was young, and it was was really important for me to 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 work good, and yeah, I'm happy with this, and I'm, but I'm also excited to to go back uh, to see everybody and to work there. Do you miss Eindhoven a little bit? Yeah, yeah, sure, sure. I I had a really good moment there. I'm now uh, I'm now living in Eindhoven for three years, and uh, it's also where my uh, my my um, baby boy is born. So. Uh, I have really a good, um, yeah, good relation with the people there. Uh, I'm good with my house, with my neighbors, and I, yeah, I'm also excited to come back there and take again this, uh, yeah, this feeling there. When do you expect to come home? Uh, normally next month. Next oh. month I will come back because the after the fourth month I can start running again on the pitch. So this will be the normally the date. And then you have rehab in Eindhoven as well? Yeah, I will finish the, from, the, from the time I will come to Eindhoven, I will stay till, uh, till I can play. Yeah, this is like one of the famous roads for the Grand Prix. Mm -hmm. It's uh, l'Avenue d'Ostend, is where like when they start, the, the start of the Grand Prix is there, yeah. this first one, and here is like the, the first uh, turn. And we are going to just uh, drive in front of the casino with all the big cars. Are you a big fan of uh, Grand Prix? Uh, not so much. Not so much? No, normally I put this when I want to sleep in the afternoon. Oh! Because it's really long, long, long and uh, uh, <laughs> repetitive, I don't know how to say in English, is every time the same thing, so uh, for me it's and the sound? falling me asleep. Also the sound <laughs> falling me asleep, so yeah. Don't but, tell, don't tell uh, Leclerc and Max to stop No, but I, I, I try to, uh, to to watch what they do every time. Yeah. Especially Leclerc because I know I know him from the middle school. Oh really? I was with him in the college. Yeah. So yeah, we are not uh, friends. We don't talk together, but I know him a little bit, so I try to follow him and also yeah. Verstappen, of course. So you showed us some of Monaco, and now we are at the beach. Why are we here? Yeah, this was uh, my summer spot. From when I was really young, from when I had, uh, I was enough old to uh, to go by myself at the beach. I was here every summer. So this one I want to show you is fully new and it's amazing. It's really nice. So it's it's what it's where I spent my uh, yeah a lot of time in my life. Yeah, you were born and raised in Monaco. How was it for you to grow up here? Yeah, I think for me there's not better place to to grow up is. Everything is, is perfect here. You have the, yeah, of course you have the sea, you have people here really nice and uh, all the, yeah, all the buildings, all the things. You have everything here, watch, everything what you need you have here. And so all the summers I was here just taking the sun and uh, playing in the, in the sea. And of course, I think we already played on, the, on this beach football also. We just put some 
you know, when you put two bags to make the goal and just play like this. Did you have an idol? When I was young, in yeah. football? Yeah, I was just looking at Zidane. At Zidane? Yeah, and also... Why? Uh, yeah, he was, on the field he was uh, magnificent. He, he, you cannot, yeah, you can, you, I think all the, the young guys just dream to play like him one day. And but I watched a lot, uh, yeah. I also watched a lot of Patrice Evra, I don't know if he... No? He played for Monaco also, so okay. he was one of the players I, uh, I grew up with. What do you do when you do your rehabilitation time to get your mind of uh, things? Yeah, I start every day from Monday to Friday from 8 to, uh, to 1. Mm -hmm. I'm working every day just like doing exercise for my knee with the swimming pool, also with the, all the machines they have. And after when I come home, I have, yeah, I have my, my, my girlfriend with my baby also. They, they help me to, to think about something else. And it's, at this moment, it's a bad moment for me, but it's a good moment to, uh, yeah, to see my, uh, my baby growing. Yeah. So I can also enjoy a lot of this. And I try to just go some small spots, restaurants, or just to think about something else, not thinking about football, about my niece. So it's, but yeah, I, I'm really happy to see my, uh, my son growing because he was born uh, five days before the game against Benfica last year. Mm -hmm. And two days after his birth, I was already on the plane. So it was a hard moment for me. But uh, yeah, I had to do it. But yeah, and uh, last year we had so many games in a row that I didn't see him a lot. So now I'm also happy with this. He al he's almost one years old. So yeah, I so see his evolution. Yeah, he has also an advantage. Yeah. Yeah, 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 of course. So we're now nearby the stadium. Um, the game is about to start. Yeah. The new season has started, but without you, how does that feel? Yeah, it feels yeah, of course, bad for me. But yeah. It's pushing me to come uh, yeah, as early as possible and yeah, I'm excited for the guys now. I know that tonight is uh, such an important game, so yeah, I will uh, support them uh, as much as possible and uh, yeah, we just uh, go for a win. Yeah, there's a new trainer, Ruud van Nistelrooy. What did you know about him already? Yeah, I know he was of course a big uh, football player, big striker. And yeah, I heard only good things about the guys. He's He's talking a lot with the guys, and he's like a, like a dad for them. So, and as you uh, as you see the game against Ajax, you saw that uh, the, the, already the, the cohesion with the guys, and of course it's the beginning, but it's coming good things, I think. How is it for you that you cannot play, um, especially in your country? Yeah, yeah, it's one of the worst thing. When I saw the the draw, it was really hard for me to, to to see the draw. But of course, I'm also happy to see the the guys performing here. So yeah. Of course, I'm excited, but yeah, still I have a small uh, regret to don't be on the pitch tonight. Yeah. With who are you going to uh, watch the game? With my girlfriend and my manager. Okay, so good luck. Yeah. Thank you so much. Thank you. Have a great rehab. Yeah. We we'll see you in Eindhoven. See you. Thank you so Thank much. Thank you. Bye bye.